Hey, Frank Strayer here, and I'm back again for a nice little overview. Um, I was asked again how um, I was creating my music and what music editors and stuff I was using. And uh, to be honest, I'm just using a program called Magic's Music Maker, and this one's version 16. And um, I basically have my own little MIDI editor and what I do here is I try to take my time a little bit and making this computerized music sound a little more um, realistic than than I could uh, as much as I could um, if you remember back I don't know 10 years ago people take uh, MIDI files and put them on their website so that when you go to these uh, entertaining websites and it would load this music, this computerized music that you could that you could tell sounds, you know, a bit fakish. So um, I spent some time trying to make things sound as realistic as possible. And on this one, um, I decided to try to uh, uh, simulate what they call like a, a heavy metal. Uh, guitar sound choppy kind of sound but I also you know I, I didn't make it as loud and I didn't make it as distorted but I made it as crunchy as I could so you know if you click on so you know you get that cat uh, that choppy kind of distorted uh, rock guitar sound and then I went ahead and I laid out some um, you know, chords so and in about four bars you can see if I hit the solo that sounds pretty nice I also kind of added a little reverb I guess and uh, yeah so and then I added a little drum and bass and it's just a simple um, kind of jazzy uh, beat just to kind of so you get kind of the idea there and then uh, all I did was just kind of stick those two together So yeah, just you know, <laughs> but uh, I guess you get kind of the idea. And um, well, there you go. And uh, I'm gonna be getting into this a little bit more and kind of creating my own music along with everything else I'm doing as far as um, visual effects, pictures, and stuff like that. And uh, well, that I hope that answers your question. Uh, if you have anything else, please let me know. Thank you.